good morning love tribes welcome welcome to sarita's intuitive love guidance this is morning coffee reading let's go ahead and get started see what is going on with your person today what is the major energies of how divine masculine or how he or she is feeling towards you divine feminine spread your wings so there's an energy here of possible freedom Maybe your person is trying to escape from a situation. And I wouldn't say escape because it honestly does sound harsh. But I do feel like this person is either branching out or trying to kind of figure out some things. And maybe they're finding their confidence. Maybe they're finally leaning into their intuition, trusting their gut. There's something here that they are expanding in. And there's an ego here with incoming love and warning omen signs. So some of you may have been experiencing some kind of conflict and tension. It may have been very recent with this lightning bolt type of energy coming through. Or you can just kind of feel the tension. And maybe that is with you or maybe you kind of can feel the tension with a third party situation you feel your person could have been battling some type of ego but now there is something coming in and it's almost like you were able to foretell the future with this omen sign like you're getting some warnings and i don't know if it's through dreams it's through other people or you're just getting these intuitive nudges something has been kind of alarming you and you're you're getting these nudges some of you may be seeing crows so pay attention if you see crows crows do represent some kind of communication and obviously an omen and so i feel that's the incoming love this person is, was battling their ego and now they're in a more of ascended lighter energy and is really trying to reconsider a situation with you divine femmes. They know that there's this one missing puzzle piece and you know what that is for you too. And so there's just a energy here of this person wanting to figure things out with you. Let me see, see what this warning sign of the omens is about. A journey. Are you or a love interest intending to travel? Perhaps you go on vacation together or a trip is planned to see each other. Wow. So I don't know how this will fit your situation, but I will try to connect the dots and navigate it for everyone's situation. I feel like if this is not an actual real travel that maybe you got a warning sign to stop, not go on a certain trip. Maybe you were planning to see your person. Then take this as a warning sign that this was either a divine intervention, divine protection. And if this is the case, then I feel like you may have either, you know, listen to your gut or you will find out when you go on this trip, if you have already, that has caused maybe some tension and conflict that now is making you kind of reconsider because you're very puzzled at a situation. You're so puzzled by something that maybe you received a message on. And they may have met well with this red rose, but I feel like they battled their ego and ego is a very selfish energy. It's pride. It's, stubbornness and if it's not an actual real travel then this is just a forward momentum you got a warning sign in moving forward with a situation with your person and i don't know if it's because of on the rebound energy here a love interest may be on the rebound he or she may feel unready for anything serious or is looking for comfort and that's my that, that's what i'm trying to say with this warning sign they may come towards you wanting something, but I don't know if they're in a, a capacity or space ready to give you everything that you need and want. And so therefore, your spirit team or a situation was divine intervention with this warning omen sign. 
and something may have happened like a tower moment that just everything has came crumbling down and now it woke you up or now it just kind of changes something i feel like if this was not a true travel then something halted you something stopped you something woke you up and i believe it's like a divine intervention with these wings you may have received a download a dream earth angels someone in your life have even even gave you the clarity or something went down that woke you up because there was some conflict and tensions coming and left you really puzzled by a situation let's see what this spread your wings energy is about fire so it could be a sagittarius leo aries and i don't know if that that sign resonates for you but this is something of a passion something ignited a fire in your person in you and there was some hard lessons here divine femmes there was some hard lessons and i don't know if this has gotten you to a point of really working on self divine femmes maybe focusing on your business focusing on school could be your mask on doing the same thing, mirroring the same energies. But I'm getting like this person also could be leaving a third party situation of them finally fueling some fire within them. And they really had to go through a spiritual awakening, had to really go through a separation, a divorce or a breakup or losing a job or something to wake them up. And this is a frequency. So this may have, they may have received this in through a download of meditation maybe they finally got their intuitive light bulb that just turned on and had an aha moment they really maybe had to go through some things in order to figure it out what is this ego energy finances and then we have fear your person is a little worried and they could be really stuck in their stubborn, selfish energy due to fear or something financially. Maybe they're worried to leave a situation due to a financial situation. Maybe there's some changes in their current environment that's holding them back. Could be a financial restraint or just something happened in their life that... Yeah, I think there was a marriage situation and I don't know if this was due to a separation, a divorce, and now you're going to receive some kind of message. Maybe there is fear of a commitment. It doesn't have to be marriage per se. And they're just so busy on their money and finances that they are operating out of their ego. But they are holding back out of fear. And you could be doing the same thing. But something's kind of haunting them. And I, I feel like it's like a past energy. Fear to either reach out to talk to you because of a situation. Let's see what this incoming love is about. Waiting. So there's, there's an energy here of them waiting for the right timing but i feel like they also feel like their time is running out as well with you like you're, there's an impatient energy and there's a priority i feel like this person has a family life family situation they're trying to provide due to a financial restraint and it doesn't have to be me per se right now maybe there's some type of priority that they felt inclined to and they did something that maybe wasn't the right timing. I also get that with this family providing energy, they may not per se have a family or maybe they do, but they're, they're so deep in their masculine energy of just working, working, working. So focused on the finances that they use work to distract themselves from being in a committed relationship with you. They may tell you that there's a priority here that they are wanting with you. 
What is this warnings omen signs about settling and triggered? Wow. So I, I do feel that this person may have came in hot for you, like what is trying to chase after you, but something triggered a situation and now has got you to really figure out some things. <laughs> it's a middle finger. Uh, and so you're kind of maybe feeling that way, like really upset, F you type of thing. Like I'm over it. I'm done. And it doesn't have to be that extreme, but there may be possible in a situation that this person came in hot and really set something off. And if they're not coming towards you at this moment, I think there is some warning trigger signs to get you to stop overthinking things or feeling hopeless because I feel like maybe you feel like this is a situation that you could be seeing other people having this love life or whatever and spirit and your divine team is like, hey, stop that. You know, don't compare. Comparison's a thief of joy. And maybe if you're being very curious about your person, they're like, don't think about them. Stay on your path, stay on your journey because the moment you you know, get off centered and worry about what your, your part your person is doing. It will get you off your alignment and spirit is just trying to wake you up. What is this conflict and tension energy about? Could be a Gemini, Libra, Aquarius could be an air sign with a, another conflict energy confused on how to move forward. And air is about communication being logical, being calculated in how to figure this situation out. Because I do feel like there may have been a lot of deceptions, a lot of secrets, maybe facade situation. And now this person is wanting to come forward, but there's just too much conflict on how to get this forgiveness, how to move forward in the relationship. Your person is really apologetic for however they may have thought that they were handling a situation with them rolling up their sleeves or maybe lack of. And it definitely feels a lot of betrayal and getting caught up in something. What does this reconsider energy about? There's a loyal energy and I feel like your person is really wanting you to reconsider maybe a situation that went down because they love you. They There's a loyal energy. They want to make this work. They're hoping that you can trust and surrender, let go and, and, and flow. But I feel like maybe there's a lot of things that needs to be settled at this moment. And so I think over time, maybe something may be significant for someone in the fall, September, October, November, December. Fall is around the corner. So let's see what they want to say to you. Angel spirits and guys, what does he or she want to say to you, Divine Femmes? What does Divine Masculines want to say to Divine Femmes? I hope to be able to find courage to contact you. So this person... If you're not in communication, they are wanting to find that courage and that strength. Something may be kind of going down. They could be battling their ego, their own insecurities, a worry of rejection or being accountable for maybe a situation that went down. It's like they're on a mountaintop. So there, there's an obstacle or challenge that they're going through and I still need you. Even though things may be kind of distant cold little to no communication they still need you even if you are rejecting them saying you're done they're like please i'll figure this out because you know why you feel like home and they're not ready to give up on you i believe in love because of you and look at this i prefer to be distracted with work than to think of our failed past and I said that earlier, this person could be working a lot with their finances, just trying to distract themselves from a situation. 
And so let's go ahead and give you an advice, Divine Femmes. What advice do you have for the Divine Femmes that are watching this? You and your loved ones are safe. And a new start is coming. So use this time for healing. Know that there's some new starts coming. A new cycle is coming. Something new and fresh. It may feel like it's not, but your spirit team is saying, hey, you're safe. Your loved one's safe. And it's okay. It's okay. It's like they keep saying it's okay. And one more advice. Because you know why it's okay? There's blessings on the horizons, Divine Femmes. On the horizon. On the horizons. On the horizon. <laughs> Open your heart up to start to receive the blessings you deserve. Because you need to stop trying to control everything. You need to learn to surrender. You are trying to control something that needs to be released. Release it. So you can receive the blessings. Alright guys, much love.